What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Back in the trailer, working on this thing, doing our final preparation for Digger Die. We went testing at Kenston Thursday night, car run good. Uh, Body-wise, chassis-wise, tune-wise, I think we're in good shape. Uh, there's a few things I want to do though. Let me show you what we got going on today. Actually, one thing I'm going to do today that this video is going to show, and I'll show you why I'm going to do it. Uh, Alright guys, if you want to support the channel, head on over to TurboJohnRacing.com, grab yourself some hats and t-shirts, other merchandise, comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks guys. We're racing at Digger Die next weekend. There's testing on Thursday at Thunder Valley. Uh, Digger Die will be there on Friday. Uh, probably not going to be getting in the race. They're doing big tire. Uh, we got some big tires we could throw on it, but I don't know if I want to chance that. Entry fee's uh, pretty high to be able to go test it and me not have any passes on big tires. So here we go. Check it out. So one of the things that I've had an issue with with this car, and all race cars generally have an issue, but um, this thing is not sealed up real good with the uh, 10. It is sealed up pretty good, but it's not. There's still little holes. The bars go through. There's lots of smoke that gets into the car when we uh, do a burnout. So one of the things is you open the door, you know, that helps. Something else that has happened that's more important than that, on some of my videos, you'll see if the GoPro is up on this window at speed, the, the window is actually pulling out. And what happens is the air pressure, it's a vacuum, right? So the air is coming, flowing over the car. Um, this has never been in a wind tunnel, but you know how the airflow works. And so as the wind goes by the door here, the pressure in the car builds up and this starts getting lower pressure it actually doesn't build up but it's lower pressure out here on the side of the car than it is on the inside so it pushes out so uh, one of the things i bought this probably i've had it probably about a year now and i've had a plan to put this in the car to help with heat in the car as well but i bought an naca duct and this was off of amazon it's just plastic it was very cheap but uh what i'm going to do is i'm going to install this thing on the sunroof and so i'm gonna pick a spot right here in the middle and if i install it this way uh, of course what will happen is it will put pressure air in the car uh, which we don't want to do so i'm going to reverse it so i'm going to go i'm going to go backwards so it's going to be down in there like this and basically at speed and this may be too big it may not really do exactly what i want it to do maybe a smaller one would have more suction but so basically at speed though, what'll happen is the air rushing over this, it's gonna create a vacuum on these and it's gonna pull it out. Um, and it should keep the door in um, to make it better, but it will should also let the smoke out, help the smoke get out of the car um, when we're doing a, a burnout. I've also, I think I'm gonna install a fan. I've got a, let me show you. I've got one of these fans. This is a blower motor out of a, um, it's a boat build blower motor. Um, four inches, this thing moves a lot of air. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mount this uh, somewhere in the car. Uh, and so that when the car is running, um, it'll have a tube and a little outlet, or I might just mount it straight and make, make a hole and just pop it down in the hole uh, in the tin somewhere like right there would be a perfect spot. Um, and basically what this will do, this should help uh, suck the smoke out of the car as well. And I got to do it in the back because, you know, we want it to suck there and it's sucking fresh air from up here. Then it should create a nice um, airflow in the car, which might help me stay a little bit cooler as well because it gets hot as I'll get out uh, in these race cars. So um, that's what we're going to be working on today. So first thing we gotta do is we gotta unscrew this, gotta take this out, see some of these bolts are missing. But we gotta, um, we get chasing the car and we're gonna unscrew this, take this out, take it home and then install this. And then once I get this installed, uh -oh, I might not be able to do it in the middle. Oh, oh shoot, I didn't even think about all that. Uh, it may be on the side over there. I may have to do it on the side, but that's okay, I don't care. Um, we can do it over right there on that side because my roll cage, is right here i just saw this so that's clearly not going to work there so i'll probably end up having to put it on, on the side over there so it'll be a little side view but uh we're going to get this thing installed um if i screw it up and I don't like it then i can always get me another piece of place glass for this all right guys so we just got the the sunroof out uh i mean you know chase we might could just go without it i wonder if that would work no i wonder if we could put like a bug deflector right here just to make it i mean because mm. it i wouldn't or, you know, maybe we could just make this smaller. I don't know. I've seen a couple people run with um, sunroofs up to create suction. 
But, uh, yeah, I guess we can put it in there. We got it all marked up. So all we got to do now, we got to go and cut it out. Uh, do a good job cutting it, getting it in place. And you can see something I didn't think of. Um, this thing is in the way, which I guess it could kind of fit like right there. But where are we going to put it, Chase? Show them where we're going to put it. We're going to put it over there in that area. Yeah, and then that way we don't have to worry about, uh, you know, getting on the roll cage or any of that good stuff. So, uh, yeah, so that's where we're going to put it. Let's All right, guys, so we're going to go get this thing installed. We'll let you know how it does when we race it this coming weekend at Digger Die. Come see us Friday and Saturday, Rockingham Dragway. Later.